Hey Pocket Classroom family, welcome back. Welcome to the video lecture on subsidiary units. So in our last two video lectures, we discussed about what are physical quantities, what are their SI units, why are some of the physical quantities called the basic physical quantities and why their SI units are called the base or the basic SI units. The video links of the lectures are given in the description box below. Please watch them then only you will be able to understand this one, subsidiary units. Now I am sure you must have seen these prefixes, deci, centi, milli, micro, nano, pico, deca, kilo, mega, giga, tera, right? Their symbols are here. This is lowercase t, lowercase c, then lowercase m, mu, lowercase n, lowercase p, D A lowercase k uppercase m g and t right and these are their multiplying factors these are some of the prefixes so examples are one decimeter is equal to 10 raised to power of minus one meter this is a multiplying factor for deci so one deci meter is equal to 0.1 meter similarly if you talk about if we talk about centimeter the multiplying factor is 10 raised to power of minus 2 therefore this is 10 raised to power of minus 2 meter that is 0 0.01 meter similarly for millimeter it's 10 raised to power of minus 3 meter then if someone asks you that what's 1 micrometer that is 10 raised to power of minus 6 meter similarly for nano for pico for deca then for mega it's 10 raised to power of 6 meter so on and so forth what's the point here the point is you always calculate these are the subsidiary units these are subsidiary units that is one decimeter one centimeter one millimeter one micrometer one nanometer one picometer one decameter one kilometer one megameter one gigameter one terameter these are all subsidiary units and the subsidiary units are calculated on they are calculated on base units as we have seen here it is one millimeter right it is one millimeter so meter is the SI unit is the SI unit of length of the length so we have calculated the decimeter the centimeter the millimeter the micrometer picometer gigameter terameter megameter this those all are calculated on meter right just the prefixes go on changing with the changing subsidiary unit okay that's always calculated on the base units but there are some exceptions there are some exceptions for example you can say we calculate micro meter right we calculate micro sorry it's millimeter so we calculate millimeter in the same way we calculate microsecond we calculate micro second second is the SI unit of time we do not calculate micro minutes we do not calculate micro minutes we do not calculate micro hours have you seen no so what's the point second second is the SI unit of time similarly meter is the SI unit of length that's what it's saying that it's always calculated on base units but there are some exceptions for example usually quite often we measure volume especially of uh, I mean of liquid in liter right we talk in terms of liter we know that the SI unit of volume is meter cube but we can say that it is 2 liter it is 3 liter right so quite often we use this liter when we talk about the volume of a given liquid okay so we can calculate one milliliter one kiloliter right so this is one exception another exception is gram now if you remember the SI unit of mass the SI unit of mass is not gram it is kilogram it is kilogram right so when we calculate the subsidiary units uh, when we talk about the mass 
we calculate it on gram it is 1 milligram not 1 milli kilogram it's 1 kilogram it's not 1 kilo kilogram since the base unit is kilogram so by this definition we should calculate it on this kilogram but it's not the case now i'm sure you will be thinking why i'm sure you will be thinking why and the reason is in the case of kilogram this kilo is already a prefix it's already a prefix that we have seen here can you see here this kilo it's already a prefix that is why we calculate the subsidiary units on gram it's one milligram one one kilogram one mil, uh, megagram okay then the next important point is no plural forms it's 10 centimeter not 10 centimeters it is 100 millimeter not 100 millimeters they don't have plural forms these subsidiary units don't have plural forms then it is one centimeter cubed cubic centimeter it means that there is one centimeter this whole unit raised to the power of three and not one centimeter cube no it's wrong this is one cubic centimeter not one centi cubic meter 